Hey guys, this is Sam. Today we're going to learn how to create a preloader in CSS. Actually, in this lesson, we are going to use pure, uh, use pure CSS3 code. So you can use this preloader instead of your animated GIFs. So let's jump into the lesson. Okay. Let me open my Sublime Text Editor. And let me create a new file circular css preloader dot html so let me save this file inside my css tutorials directory so this is the third video lesson in the series circular css preloader okay dot html HTML snippet. I'm sorry for the typo. Circular CSS preloader. Okay, let's have the container for the preloader. So with the class preloader, I just want to have tin span. Okay, so let's add a style. Let me start with uh, setting the width and height of the parent and I just want to have a inline block instead of block so and uh, position relative because I just want to have all these elements as absolute elements so I'm setting position relative okay so preloader span so to all the spans inside this preloader i'm applying these styles okay so let's make it as absolute and uh, uh, background color as black full black and with 8 pixel height 8 pixel and uh, Okay, let's see how it looks like. Okay, now you are seeing this uh, small uh, uh, square here. So I just want to have this, uh, I, I, I just want to have a circle here instead of a square. So let's make it border radius and the percentage. So now you can see the circle. Yeah. So still you are not seeing a circle but I'll tell you what is the reason for that actually we have 10 elements here we have 10 elements here but you're seeing only one it's because everything is uh, sitting on another layer so everything is on the same layer so I just want to change the layer of these elements so let me access the second element second span so n child of two I just telling them rotate yourself 36 degree let's see that I know it won't work because we didn't set the transform origin yet so where should the transform starts from so if this is the x-axis I'm telling x-axis to start from center and y from 20 pixel so now you can see the second element okay so why I gave 36 years actually all the circles starts from 0 degree to 360 degree right so we have 10 elements so just 360 by 10 36 so what I'm going to do here is to all the elements I'm going to add 36 36 to the value okay let's uh, 3 4 and 5 6 7 8 and 9 
okay now we need to adjust the degree 72 and add uh, 36 to it or not 8 I guess or not 8 144 180 216 252 288 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. yeah so we have all the elements okay 2 3 4 yeah we missed one more element 10 so 324 I saved it let's see that okay now you are seeing the circles all the 10 circles I just want to okay it's just add a margin left uh, 16 pixel just double of the value within that still we are not seeing one element one uh, one span here so let's check two three four five six seven eight nine ten sorry this should be ten okay now I just I don't want to have all circles as black color okay so let's have a different opacity I'm sorry this should be seven I'm done let's check it out okay now all we need to do is just rotate this container okay so let's add the animation here animation preloader actually this is the name I'm giving for this animation okay so this is the uh, animation duration so let's make it as one second and I want to have linear I don't want to have any speed curve you can learn about it and I just want to have infinite times okay let's add the animations here keyframes preloader don't confuse yourself with this preloader and this preloader actually this is class and this is the animation name okay so you should start from the position zero degree and you start your stop your uh, animation at 360 degree that's it okay now we are done with the preloader but see it's very fast so let's change this okay now we are ready with nice CSS preloader the nice thing about this preloader is you can scale it you don't see any pixels when you scale it okay guys thanks for watching this video and uh, if you want to uh, if you want to learn more stuff like this you just subscribe to my channel and if you want to have this source code you just check my uh, videos description to download it thanks for watching bye bye